Welcome back everybody. It's the second day of PA rifle season. We're headed right now to do some deer drives. It's always fun to do some deer drives to get out, hang with the guys. And uh, we've been doing this for years. So they said they saw a ton of deer over here yesterday and hopefully we can push them out. I know Isaac and Eli got doe tags over here and obviously we got buck tags to fill too. So hopefully there's a lot of shooting. The only bad thing is looking at the weather, there's some rain coming in probably about midday. 12 or 1 o'clock so hopefully we can get a few drives in before it starts coming down real hard but other than that we're gonna hit the woods and start pushing all these deer around all right guys we're heading in for drive number one Eli's got the GoPro he's gonna be trying to film himself I'm gonna be filming Isaac so we already just saw a deer it's starting to rain which kind of stinks but Hopefully there's a bunch of deer in here. Get a shot at one. It's brushy. Yeah, it's too brushy. Yeah, it's gonna get a shot. What about now? That one's. Are they both fawns? No. The one in front's big. Great tour, D. Lai. Isaac, Isaac, hey, hey, right there. Wait, it's gonna fall over. You got it. You got it. You got it. Sweet, dude, that was good. That Roll down the hill. Just wrapped up the first drive. Had action right at the beginning. Isaac and I had a doe and a fawn come down below us and we could have maybe shot it, but we knew it was gonna come right out to where Eli is. He's down the ridge farther than us. And sure enough, we hear shooting. And uh, next thing we know, that deer comes running up toward us. And I, I think on camera, we're gonna be able to see it fall, fall down. It ran right close to Isaac and I, but unfortunately Eli had the GoPro on, but it was, ended up being dead. So you're not gonna see the footage from that, but at least you get, got to see the deer fall down. They're looking at Isaac. They're... Here they come. That's, that's a so spike. Big. Big. That's a buck. No, Not a shooter. Right here, there's a doe. Stopped. 
dropped her. Nice shot. <laughs> yes. You smoked her. Holy cow, this is crazy. Oh. Yes. Jeez. Holy man. She dropped her. I wasn't shooting. That buck wasn't big. No, the buck wasn't big, but I, I just saw tines, and I'm like, it's a buck, and I saw its white antlers. So did I. I was on him, but... There was a spike, and then that buck. There's another deer right there. Staring at us. Big doe. Where? Straight, right in front of us. I can just see its chest staring at us. Would I be able to shoot it if I didn't get that one? Yeah. There it goes. Oh, yeah. Wow, this was a wild drive. Yeah. Holy man. Honest. All right, Joel and I got to the spot. We were pushing a side hill. We saw a pile of deer run up down below us. There's a bunch of shooting and then I don't know if it was the same group or not. I think it was. The one guy shot below us and they all came sprinting up toward us. There was buck running everywhere. They weren't quite big enough. And then there was a couple of big doe that stopped right here and I dropped one of them. So I think Joel got on video. Unfortunately, I turned my GoPro off and apparently when I clicked it, it didn't go back on. But yeah, we're having GoPro troubles today. <laughs> we got a doe down anyway. A bunch of shooting. So I don't know, at least a couple of people down the line from a shot and then the guy right next to a shot. So might have a few down. Wow, dude, that's a cow. Oh, here, get behind that and hold that thing's head up. Holy crap, that's a cat dog. Man, look at that bullet. Dude. He smoked it. That is a huge doe, guys. Holy like, the camera doesn't do it justice how big this is. Wow. Sweet. Got to get her tagged and cleaned, I guess. It's starting to rain. There's more coming. Man, there's, they're right there. Man, man, shoot it. Oh, yeah, they're fawns. I think you missed that first one, didn't you? It saw us standing there. We were by that far tree right there. I looked in, when I was looking at the video, I looked like he missed, but we'll just look. Well guys, we just looked for blood for a little bit and um, uh, the neighbor's dogs are going nuts, but we thought we thought we missed it, but we just double checking just to be 100% positive. 
and uh, she eventually just ran up over this hill but then her two fawns came down um, two fawns came down below us and we could have shot those but they were just too small so we didn't good drive nonetheless so I had more shots fired on this one so we'll see what the next drive brings okay guys that's a wrap on today we ended up shooting a few deer and um, that last drive was a bust we didn't see any deer we did see a fox though so that was kind of cool but I want to talk a little bit more about that deer that Matt ended up missing we watched the footage back and he just barely missed it. The deer started to turn and wheel, and he shot right over it. We looked for blood for a little bit just to be safe, but there was nothing, so. Super close to getting another one on the ground, but we didn't, unfortunately. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know a lot of you love deer drives. We love doing it as well, so if you haven't yet, click that subscribe button, and I'm sure there'll be more videos coming soon. We still have a lot of tags to fill, so. Click that subscribe button, and we'll see you on the next one.